a video review for Transformers Combiner Wars Legends Groove. Uh, now, he is a legend, so he's not the full-scale deluxe. He's been replaced by Rook uh, in the Combiner team. Maybe we'll see a deluxe Groove uh, when the Japanese version comes out. They've been really sticklers about making sure all the original G1 guys are there, so I guess we'll find out when they show off theirs. But uh, in the American version right now, he is a Legends, and he forms a little chest plate, much like Blackjack does for Minasaur. I mean, he's just a little motorcycle, um, and here he is, uh, just to show off Hotspot later, but uh, just to give you an idea about how big he is next to Hotspot, or next to uh, Streetwise here. So he's a small little motorcycle, but uh, semi-in scale with uh, the other vehicles. And he's a fun little robot. See, just a, back wheel rolls, front wheel rolls. He's got a little kickstand, and it, he can lean on as well as he's got a peg over here that uh, keeps him from falling over. Transformation is very basic. Uh, you flip his arms out like this. Uh, then these whole pieces come down and hook around like this. Oh, we'll leave that up. Uh, his legs split. Um, when going back... You can see there's three tabs on each wheel, and you want to make sure those alternate. You'll see the little slot, tab, slot, tab, slot. So when you're putting them together, you want to make sure those line up correctly in order to peg the whole back half together. And you just flip his feet down. Uh, flip this down like this. Bring his torso down. That forms his chest. And there he is. That's all there is to it. It's a, he's very basic, but he looks like Groove. He's a fun little guy. He's got some really long, lanky legs. Long, linky legs. La, 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 la. Landau, Luckman, and Lake. And the core. Anyway, <laughs> now I'm just getting into comic book references. Um, but yeah, he's got ball-jointed shoulders, ball-jointed elbows, ball-jointed hips and hinge knees, much like uh, Warpath did. I mean, he does have a little extra joint. Again, it doesn't go back. It's got a little tab to prevent it from going back any further. Uh, I don't know why you'd want to bend it forward. Uh, it's mostly there for transformation, but you can get a little bit of extra movement out of the ankles there. No waist swivel. Um, his head appears to be fixed in place. Oh, no, his head does turn a little bit, but again, because of the cowl behind his head and everything else, it doesn't really move much. It doesn't really seem like it's worth it to force it. He's got a little Autobot logo right up there. And like I said, he does also form a chest plate uh, for Defensor, and it's basically just kind of We'll show it off in the combined mode, but it's basically just kind of folding him up. We're getting his legs down. Oh, here we go. I guess his arms come back like this. I'm not entirely sure, but it's, ba it's basically just kind of folding him up like this and plugging him on to uh, maybe fold these up. Just something like that, and it plugs into the Defensor's chest. Maybe his arms come up like this. Very basic, very wide. You see, he does have a peg, and it looks like he'll peg on pretty securely. It looks like these will probably work to peg him in. Uh, but we'll show that off in the combined mode uh, with him as a chest plate. So, yeah, basic, simple, fun Legends Groove. He comes with his bio card. Again, Legends inspired art. I don't know if that was actually from the game because I haven't seen it recently. Um, and his little folded up. See, there he's all folded up for his uh, torso mode. And it's nice that they show it in, in here. Um, and just his transformation instructions. So, yeah, there's Legends Groove. Now we get on to the big boys.